Dieting to lose weight. Dieting to lose weight is just as hard or as easy as changing the habit. One way to look at this is to see how the habit formed. Habits do not take place overnight. It is an accumulation of little things done over a course of time until the effect sets in. Likewise, dieting to be really effective has to be gradual. So for now, stay off the crash dieting, fast reducing and fast fat burning menus, pills and concoctions. It may guarantee to reduce your weight but not your nutrition and well-being. True there are specific foods and food preparations that benefits particular health and weight issues. True also that fast reducing concoctions and food preparations are prepared not to really make you enjoy the simple pleasures of life like a good meal but for you to endure it. It is so easy to agree that there are hard rules to observe in order to lose weight fast without suffering and ensure good nutrition in the process too. It is so politically correct to mention that all the so-called weight-reducing products do wonders for the body. Being politically correct though is not being honest. The fact is everyone has claims, but nothing is officially proven in the entire area of dieting to lose weight. Not one fast weight loss program is endorsed by a credible health organization. The best that is said is that a certain product is under study, is under weighty consideration, or is still waiting laboratory confirmation. Until then, stay off it but here are things that you can do to regain your ideal weight while being kind to your body in the process. Decide now. Make small changes in your attitude to food. The little changes you make now will spell a lot of weight and nutrition problems later. Look at it as an investment. Treat it as a way of loving yourself. It is like this. If we want for example to prepare for retirement, we start saving early. The earlier we start the better and the longer the lead time we have to save. The more we save the better we enjoy. Likewise, reducing the amount of food that we eat today, no matter how small the portions are, when done over time will ultimately be the difference between being obese or fit. It will spell the difference between being healthy or ill and between being fashionable or waddling in oversized clothes. Changing the eating habit cannot be put off for long because the longer it takes for a person to take resolve, the harder the effort to make the resolve becomes. Eat well. Every food has its purpose. Food in any region did not just happen. It is there for the people to enjoy and to take the right and balanced nourishment. It is the choices, the preferences, and the current activity that limits the nourishment provided to the body. So eat well. Get nutrition from all the six food groups and do it regularly. The main reason that there is too much noise regarding overweight is not because there is fat, sodium, and sugar in the meal. It is because today, 150 million people are obese because they eat more than three times the required daily intake of fat and calories. Pump iron. Dieting to lose weight is not complete when not coupled with exercises. While eating the right foods in the right proportion, exercise. It will help to distribute the correct nourishment to the targeted areas in the body. And then you enjoy, live well, feel good, and look good. For more free educational content, visit learnforfree.biz. Content produced and distributed by AllSuperInfo.